Hello ladies and gents out there, this is me, Evan, your friend in some really exciting tutorials out there. In this video, I'm not gonna show you something exciting and creative, I will just try to help you overcome a fear uh, of Mac users when the very fine process of a DMG file is stuck. So uh, I will just show you how to escape from this madness because most of the times when we download applications from the internet, uh, applications just like this one, the own one photo row, we get, uh, for a reason that I don't know, we get an error, we get a stuck uh, process of the verifying uh, of, the, of the DMG. I don't know whose fault is uh, the software application or the operation system. My job here is not to, you know, to accuse someone. My job here is to help you overcome this problem. And if you are here, you know what I'm talking about. So let's just see how you will overcome this problem. First of all, I will just fire up this little DMG file because uh, this file actually uh, creates uh, created this problem for me today. So uh, this little problem is the reason for this video. I'll just fire it up with double click. As you can see, we're getting the very fine process. And, and then when I will just try to, uh, you know, run this puppy here with double click, I will just uh, get uh, a pop-up window, a process, but this process is stuck, as you can see. So this is the problem I'm talking about, the very fine process of the PKG or the DMD, whatever, uh, file uh, is stuck. And uh, we need to pass this process in order to run the software. Sometimes you know, we, we buy software and we really need to, uh, to have everything, you know, easy, easy going because we paid and uh, we paid the software and we need it to run smoothly for us. We don't really know how to solve these little headaches and we don't really need that kind of problems. So I will just show you right now how you will easily uh, overcome this problem. The only thing that you have to do is to go here, actually select or open a finder window. I'm pretty sure that you know how to open a finder window from here, okay? And then you will just use the following shortcut in order to open a little window that will take us to another level. So just hold the command, the shift and the G. And as you can see here, the go to folder pop up uh, window had just been popped. <laughs> and then you will just uh, use the system library core services. I will paste this uh, path below in the descriptions of the video in order to have it and just paste it uh, on your own. And once you will just hit the go button, you will go here. As you can see, is a new set of uh, you, uh, utility let's say or applications i don't really know uh, the only thing that i know is that the installer will uh, actually help uh, overcome the problem it will do it automatically or manually i will just see right away sometimes uh, once this um, this uh, dmg file is uh, is loaded and of course inside there is this PKG uh, application, or let's say, I don't know, installation uh, application. Um, one, sometimes when it's this, uh, when this is loaded up, it will start automatically the procedure. If it doesn't work, I'll just show you how to do it manually. Just double click, and I'm just waiting for the installer to pop up. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. As you can see here, it doesn't, it doesn't. Uh, there it is, wonderful. So the installer is here, but nothing is up. As you can see, the installer is a, is a demonic application. It does, uh, you know, strange things sometimes. No problem. As you can see here, the finder has changed and now we see the installer. If you don't see that, if you see the finder, just click on this one. Okay? Or just double click the installer. You will get the finder transformed to installer then. And then I will go to File, Open. And then I will just go to the on one, photo, raw, etc. And I will just select this PKG file, this one. The problematic, as you remember. And then I will just hit the open and voila, my friends. This little shitty here is still stuck, but I have overcome this problem. And now 
um, uh, free to install the application without headaches. So uh, that was the video actually. I have just showed you how to overcome this problem and uh, you know escape from some stacking process or verifying because we really need our uh, pretty expensive machines to work properly and we don't really need headaches. So if you like the video, please like my work and uh, my work, actually not my work. And um, don't forget to subscribe because I do many other kind of tutorials, creative most of the times. And uh, if you would like to share this with your friends, if you find it uh, useful or funny or I don't know what, just send it to your friends and this will help me uh, grow my channel and uh, create more video for you. So have fun my friends and keep working with your stacked shitty programs.